The comment comes as Prince William has taken part in a rare Candid podcast, which was released this morning. It saw Prince William journey on a walk through the Queen's Sandringham estate to his country home of Anmer Hall. He spoke frankly about the effect his work as an air ambulance pilot had on his mental health. Royal expert Ingrid Seward spoke about the brothers on GB News. She said, it's typical, I think in California a lot of people speak like that. William speaks completely straight and you understand what HES saying. She added, it's Harry's anger and William's acceptance of the situation, William ISNT blaming anyone, HES blaming himself for his problem. His job, which was very traumatic at times, he explains that beautifully. H is not laying blame, HES taking a responsibility himself and mending it. I think that's what really really shows the difference between the two brothers. They're really coming from a completely different place mentally. The Duke recalled an accident during his time as an air ambulance pilot which seemed to have left a lasting impression which involved a child, who would have been a similar age to his eldest son, Prince George. William said the youngster who was hit by a car was in serious difficulty and his parents were hysterical. William said, first went home that night pretty upset but not noticeably. I wasn't in tears, but inside I felt something had changed. I felt a sort of, a real tension inside of me. And then, the next day, going back in again to work, you know, different crew. On to the next job. And that's the thing, you're not always all together. So then you can't spend a day processing it, he added. The prince said the impact of attending the accident really hit him weeks later. I felt like the whole world was dying. It's an extraordinary feeling. You just feel everyone's in pain, everyone, he added, and that's not me. I've never felt that before. My personal life and everything was absolutely fine.